This is Family on YouTube. Family's Monstober Makeover shows you how you can look spooktacular this Halloween. Hi everyone, I'm Candace, your Monster and Makeover Specialist. Now let's get started with the Monstober Werewolf Edition. Hi Weiss, I'm Candace. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, have a seat. Are you ready to become a werewolf? Yeah. Let's hear your werewolf howl. Are you ready? Step one, start with a clean, dry face. Then using a makeup sponge, dab gray makeup or face paint around the face to make the face look drawn. Then add a light brown colored makeup to the sides of the head, under the eyes, around the mouth and cheeks. Blend into the hairline. Use a dark brown color underneath the cheekbone, on the ears, around the nose and mouth, the hairline, on the forehead, and around the eyes. This will create depth and scariness, which is good. Press in a translucent loose powder to set the makeup. Step two. With a black eyeliner pencil, draw on thick, wolf-like eyebrows. Here's a tip. Scrunch up your nose to make as many lines as possible. Then trace them with your black eyeliner pencil. Darken the end of the nose, the middle of the upper lip, and add a thick outline around the lips. Step three, use black face paint to darken and shine the tip of your nose, the lips, the eyelids, and carefully just under the lower lashes. Step four, create the look of werewolf hair by adding white, then brown, and black makeup lines. Sponge lightly to blend the different colored lines together. Looking good. Now if you want to take your costume further, you can look for some werewolf features at your local costume store. Like ears, hair, fangs, and if you feel comfortable, colored contact lenses. Ready, wife? Ready to see your werewolf? And that's how you can become a scary werewolf this Halloween. For details, see Monstrover Makeovers on family.ca.